Hey folks, just stopped at Tiny Town on the way down from the mountains and I wanted to do a little video on this. And I was hoping to do some detecting, but I don't think that's possible. Anyways, I'll give you a look around. Everything is miniature for the little kids and uh, little miniature turntable there. And they can ride the train and, well, I'll show you. I've never been here myself, but uh, I've known of it. But it'd be really good for the little kids, especially riding the train and see all the little things that I'm about to show you. Plus it's in the mountains, so that's even better. All right, we'll start at this and then I'll, I'll go back to the other end. And as you can see the Train, track, train tracks will go around and a little miniature spruce lodge. Little Coney Island where we just came from. Another little house with a porch. A little church <laughs> now this cracks now this cracks me up now everything is miniature in this tiny town hence the name so I wonder if the security cameras are those little tiny dollhouse dollhouse cameras all right in the train Train will go around on the bridge and So this is be interesting to see once it gets an operation in warmer weather. Miniature windmill. And over here we have a real caboose. Unfortunately, they no longer use on the rail lines. There's a little water uh, water tank for the steam engine, well, the miniature one, anyways. Got the volunteer engineers posted over there, if you can see it. And there's the remainder of the miniature town. Oh, they even have uh, mine miniature mines up in the mountain up in the mountainside there. And still, I wonder.
Donna's place. I heard they got good food. And next to the medical center in case uh, something goes wrong. It goes on for quite a ways. And like I said, the kids would get a kick out of this. Almost fell again. Looks like old miners' cabins, miniature ones. As you can see, it does go on for quite a ways. Nice little walking path and resting area. I just gotta be careful because people fly on this road. A miniature Home Depot. Is that a miniature funeral home over there? Sure does look like it. Sorry, there's a snowbank right on the edge of the road, so. Well, that's quite the house over there for being a miniature. Imagine the mayor would live there. At least he waved. Back in Wisconsin, you used to wave at everyone. I move out here and you wave at somebody and they just uh, 
give you a dirty look or don't do anything. All right, and then that circles around to another bridge. So it bigs, uh, makes a big uh, U shape, or actually not even a U, a uh, whatever word I'm looking for, oval. All right, the end of the line here. Oh, it's the other way. All right, well, we'll head back that way then. And this is someone's private residence, so... so let's go check out the bridge. And there's the uh, train trestle. Oh, this is nifty. Wonder how old this is. Huh. Really pretty back here. There's some houses off in the distance in the hillside there. Miniature ones. To go with the miniature town. Oh, that's a pretty shot. I think I'll take a picture of that. All right, well, this is somebody's property. So I will head on back. I wanted to give you a shot of the tiny town and uh, see what it's like. And we'll, it's uh, gonna be a little warmer tomorrow. So I wanna get out and do some more detecting. But later in the week, next week, I believe it's supposed to be in the 70s, at least for a while. So I will see you next time.